What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Happy New Week to y'all. I hope y'all having a great day. I'm having a great day, and I'm happy to be back here to give you guys more content. We are starting off the week with a Zach rushing video. I've been meaning to play catch up with my list of videos, guys. Don't worry. If you made a request, more likely than not, I will do it, but sometimes I choose not to do it. So I consider all of your suggestions, but I will not do every single one. I'll watch it, though. I'll watch it if I don't make a video for it. I'll do that at least. Um, but also, before we begin, let me tell y'all, I woke up to this morning. I woke up to a notification from Google saying that, or asking me rather, did I request a password change to my account? Heck no. So, I assume someone's trying to hack my account. I ain't even famous yet. <laughs> I don't even want to be famous. But for the hackers out there, stop it. Get some help. Um, we're gonna hop into it. Drop a like, comment, subscribe, share, hit the bell notification. So I know when I drop some more heat for y'all and let's go. It is common knowledge that a man and a woman in a relationship are gonna argue. You can't get around yes. it, you can't go over it, you gotta go through it. That's just simple as that. Now, with that being said, it is a consensus understanding among men that we're gonna lose 99.9% .9 of those arguments for the simple fact that we just get tired of talking about the same shit and we're gonna tell you whatever you wanna hear in order to where you'll just shut up. That's a real hmm. thing. Like it or not, it's the truth. But that 0.1% is the moment that men live for. We wait okay. years in order to get that 0.1%. <laughs> so let me tell y'all what's done happen because I finally won an argument to the point oh, where Sarah Barrett, that's my girlfriend, she was just sitting there so dumbfounded at the fact that she had nothing to say back because there was no way in hell that she was going to contradict my logic. Let me tell y'all what's right. going Now, Let's go. last night, me and Sarah Barrett, that's my girlfriend, we go to dinner. We're sitting at the table and we're flipping through the menus. Now, I'm one of these people that I'm a people watcher. Now, I look at the menu and I knew what I wanted as soon as we come in there, so I'm just basically looking around and taking in the whole ambiance of the whole place. Yeah. There's another couple that comes in, sits down at a table about eight foot from us. Now, I'm not one of these people that can hide what I'm thinking. So I'm <laughs> looking, and I'm not ashamed of it. <laughs> and Sarah looks at me, and she goes, Zach. I said, yeah, what's up, man? She goes, we both see it. I said, okay. And I went right okay. back to staring. She goes, Zach. I said, what? She goes, you can't stare. I said, why? And I went back to stare. <laughs> she said, Zach, stop it. I said, what? what? What am I doing so wrong? She goes, Zach, you can't stare at people like that. I said, I can, and let me tell you why. Because this, I knew right away that this is that 0.1% that men live for. I'm fitting to win this argument. <laughs> I said, did you see that person over there? She said, yeah, I seen him. I said, did you happen to notice the fact that they have blue hair? She goes, yes, I, I, I noticed that. I said, did you ha also happen to realize the fact that it, there's like three lip rings and two eyebrow rings and a nose ring and all this other <laughs> shit in their face? She goes, yes, Zach, people do that. That's okay. That's even expressing themselves. You have to be accepting of that. I said, I'm, ex and I was louder than what I should be. I said, I'm accepting the fact that they want to look like a smurf that's headed to a biker rally. I have ah. an issue with that. I'm doing what they want me to do. She said, what do you mean? I said, you don't do shit like that unless you want someone to admire it. Because here's the damn logic of the situation. If you dye your damn hair blue, it doesn't just go blue after one treatment. You have to go multiple times in order to get it to baby Smurf blue over there. Okay, you right. put in time for that. Not only that, but I'm pretty sure you can't poke that many holes in your face at one time without catching some kind of an infection. So obviously they put a lot of work and time and money into that as well in order to be admired. They want to express themselves while well, I'm admiring their expression. You don't paint your damn hair blue and fill your face like you just fell in a plain old tackle box full of devil horses and beetle spans if you don't want somebody to stare at you. You know why? Because you, um, she, um, she stopped me right then. She goes, Zach, they're expressing themselves. I said, they can't fucking see it. They didn't do that for them. Can you see the hair You're on your right. head? No, you can't see it. You do shit like that to where other people can see it. Do you think a sculptor spends countless hours on a statue and then wants people to be like, and look away from it? No, <laughs> they want you to admire their art. Well, they decided to do art on their face. 
and I'm admiring it. And I refuse to not stare at them because that is my duty as a decent person to take into consideration the fact that they spent all that time, money, and pain to go through that right there in order to express themselves. I'm doing what they want me to do, which is admire them. And she just looked at me and she goes, because she knew she lost the argument. And you know what I did? Nah. Went right back <laughs> to staring. Right and back to staring. they were above it. Because he gave me one of them not nah, things like people do when <laughs> yeah. I stared. Yeah. I stared for two or three minutes. I'm not ashamed of it. Nope. I'm not going to be part of the whole situation that dims that person's shine because they put a lot of work into that shit. Am I going to do it? You're right. Things? Absolutely not. Am I accepting of the fact that they did it to theirs and going to give them the recognition they deserve? Absolutely. I want an argument. I'm going down in history. You're not taking this from me. Shit. The one argument argue for right reasons, man. I wholeheartedly agree with that. You know, when people do not outlandish, but out there things as such. Yeah, you know, they do it for themselves because they like it. And they love when other people like it. So, yeah, no, I wholeheartedly agree, Zach. Um, I, I I myself, personally, I don't plan on getting any more piercings. I, I only got, like, these two earrings right here. But tattoos, that's another story. I don't have any yet, but I plan on getting some. My first one won't be on this bad boy right here. It's going to be in a, a very colorful owl. Um, And then, who knows, it, it it's probably going to become a slippery slope. It's going to be both arms and then the chest then the back and... Yeah, I'm going to do that after I quit my job. Thanks to you all. <laughs> um, good way to start the week. Appreciate y'all for watching. Old and new subs. Stay tuned for more content. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace out.